Hi, Brian LaBelle here doing a uh, demonstration of um, hooking up the microphone for the Chayo Stageman sound system. Um, here is the sound system it itself, and here is the microphone uh, and the instruction manual. We're on uh, page 15 of the manual today. Um, but here is the, the microphone. Um, you can see the label here, um, it's SQ6100 IRDA. Uh, the IRDA is a communication mode between uh, the microphone and the receiver and vice versa. So they keep in touch with each other. Um, first thing to do though is you install the fresh uh, alkaline batteries in the transmitter. Uh, you can see the plus sign is slid towards the top. There's two batteries in here. Uh, once they're in there, uh, before you put the cover back on, uh, turn the microphone on and you'll see right now that this particular mic has been set to the default setting of uh, channel 1 and you can see it's matched up on the receiver there. The uh, blue light is on right here showing that you have a connection between the microphone uh, and talk in the microphone and you see it's working. Now, uh, in some situations, you might want to change the channel if there's interference with the local uh, TV channel or you're not getting the uh, broadcast range that you're supposed to get, uh, you might want to change the channel. Now, if you look on the receiver right here, you see there's a little window right there. That is where it transmits from when you're communicating with the microphone. Um, and if you look at the microphone itself, on the back of it, there's this little IRDA window right here. So when you're setting different channels between the microphone and the receiver, you have to take this window and actually hold it in front of the window on the, on the uh, uh, receiver. So in this case here, it's set to channel one. So let's go ahead and set it to uh, channel two. Well, let's try channel three. Now you see we lost the RF lock, so there's no communication right now. So what we're going to do is take this window again and put it up towards the receiver. And then we're going to push this little sync button here. So here we go. I pushed it. You can see the blue light lit up on the uh, handheld microphone just for a split second. Um, you can see now that it's changed to channel 3 and you can see that the blue RF lock light is on now showing it's communicating. And again, uh, check 1, 2, 3, 1, 2. Uh, we have communication. So that is how you do that.